Hello everyone, this is Lakshman. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to discuss about uh, the top 5 Agile entry questions and answers. The first question is, what is daily stand-up meeting? So, it is one of the entry questions on Agile. Uh, definitely, we will ask uh, in the technical round. So, every day, uh, there will be one meeting in the morning or evening time. Okay, the team meets uh, in one place and uh, there will be uh, more than 50 minutes uh, the, uh, the daily stand-up meeting is happens. So in that me meeting, uh, they were discussed about like, uh, what did you do yesterday? And uh, what do you plan on doing today? And are there any blocks or impediments uh, that keep you from doing your work so these type of uh, discussion these type of questions uh, will ask each and every person and they have to give a proper reply a proper answer for these questions in the in the meeting okay so uh, the, in the daily stand up meeting these type of uh, discussions will happen so, so what you have done yesterday and what you are going to do today and uh, and what plan you have doing today and are there any blocks are there uh, to keep you from doing your work is there any problem any issues are there uh, to go further process so this type of discussion uh, in the daily uh, stand up meeting is happens and next question is what what the uh, meaning of sprint planning meeting in the sprint planning the product owner uh, represents the goal of the sprint and discuss the high priority product backlog items. That means whatever the uh, task you have to achieve, you have to do uh, the priority wise, uh, the product owner will choose the high, high priority items. Okay. And uh, the delivery team then chooses the amount of work for the next sprint. So whatever the product owner chosen by uh, some uh, product backlog items, then the delivery team, the development uh, team, then chooses the amount of work for the uh, next sprint. That is nothing. These things are discussed in the sprint planning meeting. So how much time it takes to complete uh, the sprint, whether it take uh, one week or two weeks or so they will calculate each and everything in the sprint planning meeting uh, whatever the product owner is assigned the product black items okay the next question is immediately ask uh, what is the role of scrum master so uh, the scrum master serves the team and shields them from any distraction that could prevent them from completing a sprint goal so whatever the task has given by product owner so is there any back uh, blocks is happening is uh, the work process is going smooth or not according to our sprint time sprint planning meeting so is everything uh, will handle by scrum master only okay so uh, they also remove blocks teach the team to become self organized and serve as a coach who teaches uh, Agile and Scrum values and principles. So this is the role of a Scrum Master. So the next question is, why should uh, we have to go waterfall over Scrum? Why should we use waterfall over Scrum? If you if use waterfall, uh, if the requirements are simple, predictable, uh, fully defined and understand and will not change in the future so by that time you should go waterfall over the scrum because it's very simple and there is no there, there is no uh, dynamic is there and uh, it is constant and uh, uh, it, it will not change in the future also so by that time you should choose waterfall only so if the requirements are very simple and predictable and you know, uh, you you have you have very clear idea about uh, your requirements, and it is very uh, uh, well fully defined and understand. Then we should go waterfall.
The next question is What type of uh, matrices or reports have you used? In the sprint, uh, release, burn down, and burn up charts are standard reports. Usually, uh, these are uh, very uh, frequently used charts burn down and burn up. So, most companies also want to understand how many stories were committed uh, versus completed per sprint and the number of defects identified post release to production. So, these uh, burn down and burn up charts are uh, will do comparison will, will give us uh, analysis of the uh, software or product then you immediately get down what is a burn down chart burn down chart displays the amount of work a team has burned through such as hours during the sprint and also you should you also discuss how you have used these in the past okay so these are the uh, top uh, agile entry questions and an answers for developers or testers so everyone can prepare these entry questions and also uh, support us and follow my youtube channel and share our videos and likes our videos i will uh, upload every day on latest technology videos so thank you